If you are also a big fan of Pokemon Go, then you must be aware of soft bans. This video will share how to avoid as well as remove soft bans. The duration of a soft ban varies, depending on the type of violation. It may last from a few minutes to a few hours. What if you are unfortunate to receive a soft ban? Here are a few ways to help you get in touch with it. First, the easiest way is to wait up to 12 hours for your game to hopefully resume. You can play another game while you wait. For the second, you can try spinning the coin 40 times on Pokestop to remove the soft ban. This method may not work for everyone though. Third, create a new account and play the game for a few minutes. Then delete the app again and reinstall it. Once the installation is complete, log into the banned account again and the soft ban may has been lifted. The same, this method doesn't work for everyone. For the last one, it is recommended that you contact the Pokemon Go Help Center. If you have tried everything and waited for more than a day, you can contact the Pokemon Go Help Center. They may be able to help you. If you want to do location spoofing safely then I must recommend you Pogaskill, which is very reliable and can prevent you from receiving a soft ban. Pogaskill is a the most safest GPS spoofer device created specifically for Pokemon Go. Not only does it enable automatic walking, but it also adds joystick to Pokemon Go. The most important feature of Pogoskill is the cooldown timer. It counts down to tell you when it's safe to spoof the location. You can also adjust the speed of movement based on walking and biking to mimic natural movement. Also, it can set up route walking, which is really handy. You can find a detailed tutorial on how to install it and how to use it in a previous video on our channel. Go ahead and give it a try. Well, that's all for today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.